this is Bobby. This is Shelly. And we're from Shill Bob Around. And today we're taking you on a little adventure today. We're gone for a drive and uh, we're right now on the Cabot Trail of Cape Breton. And uh, we're not quite sure of the destination, but right now we're driving through the Marguerites and uh, we'll uh, take you along with our little adventure today. See you later. I forgot to tell you what the temperature is today. It's 27 degrees Celsius today in Cape Breton. So it's, and it's muggy. So we have a pretty nice day today. Take you down to the uh, Lake Ola Picnic Park. It has some portable washrooms there. And you can picnic. You can swim. You can fish. And you can bring everybody here. It's senior friendly, wheelchair friendly. They have a dock there for the wheelchairs so you can go out and if you're handicapped you can um, fish on the dock. Marguerite River is well known for its trout and Atlantic salmon fly fishery. This draws anglers from near and far. Marguerite River was designated a Canadian Heritage River in 1998. section here. Um, you could either go over the bridge that is right there. You can see barely. So there's the bridge there. You can go that way to go to Shetty Camp and go around the trail that way or you can turn left and you can go to Inverness on uh, Route 219. So that way is Shetty Camp, and this way is uh, Highway 219. And this is not part of the Cabot Trail. This is not part of the Cabot Trail. However, it is a beautiful just scenic ride. Um, yeah, just as beautiful. You're on the, you, you're driving along the ocean, and uh, we quite like driving this way. Lots out on the raft. Beautiful beach. So like any dirt road in Cape Breton, some of them you find beautiful things. And here is another gem. It's called Chimney Corner Beach.
feet on the water. Beautiful campground. Another beautiful beach too. This is the beach at Dunvegan Campground. Oh, I'm a cloud beach in Dunvegan. Beautiful. So we're going to continue on the road that uh, Clouds Beach Campground is on. So this is going to go along the ocean as well. So right here, you see the Cabot Cliffs Golf Course. It is one of, uh, it's in the top 10, I believe, in Canada. Top five. Maybe even in the top five, but that's Cabot Cliffs, and they have another one that's up the beach called um, Cabot, Cabot Links. So uh, yeah, check them out, and um, we'll take you for a ride down by the each of their, their villages there. There's not much signage on the road for this beautiful little golf course, but like you say, all dirt roads are little roads. Again, there's a beautiful beach here as well. There's Route 19 Brewery. You go in some, for some cold ones and something to eat in there. We're coming into the town of Inverness. This is the Cabot Lynx golf course. You go in and they have 
have a hotel there that you can stay and a eatery called the Wits Public House. Inverness was once a mining town. Yeah, that's all built on all mining property. So, Bobby just said coal mining. coal mining. It was this property was used to be a mine, and <clears throat> now we got a golf course on it. <laughs> I don't know if they strip mine or had shaft mining, but uh, this is all. see the water from every hole. So. And you can hit some balls in the water, right, Bobby? Uh, yeah, if you're as bad as I am. Yeah, I, I remember. Not intentionally. Not intentionally, but um, if if you're in Canada and you watch the Lotto 649 commercial, the the hole number 16, I believe it is, is featured in that commercial. And well, I don't know what hole it is. I think it's 16. Par 3, anyway. It's surrounded <clears throat> by ocean and it's it's uh, definitely definitely a hole that you uh, can hit the sand in more than one ways by the ocean. So this beach is handicap accessible. They have some wheelchairs that they provide for you that you can take down to the beach. It's not a map they have in the water. So everybody gets to feel the water and Is 25 degrees and the water temperature is 21. So, yes, yeah, so this is the, uh, the handicap or accessible ramp. And it usually goes to the water, but today I'm not, not sure why it's not all the way to the water. Or oh, the tires and the wheelchair will take you down because they're big tires, that's why. And there's lots of sea glass, believe it or not, on this beach. Somebody's flying kite up there, I don't know. I'm to get in the water. Woo! Oh, never warm. Wow. Must be high tide because there's a little uh, rock right here. Well, that concludes a couple of hours of our drive. Stay tuned for the rest of the video coming up next week. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel, like our channel, and share to your friends. Thank you.